Hi, good evening. Welcome to Cooking Uncovered. My name is Miriam and tonight I'm going to demonstrate the best way, the most efficient way to um, cut up a pepper, a bell pepper, so that you don't have the mess all over your board. So here in front of me I have my, um, my bowl that I'll put all the garbage in that I don't want to keep for my stew or my soup. And I'm going to show you. So I've washed the pepper. So all you do with your very sharp knife, just take off the four walls. So this one here, like that, and the second wall. And I also try to not take the white membrane of the pith with me. So that goes, for third wall. Now I can turn it over and I can see what I'm doing. And see here, this, see the seeds? They're still intact. Now I'm going to cut the fourth wall off whilst keeping all of the seeds intact inside. Not one seed on my board. Now, so that you don't waste, I am just going to quickly cut off this bottom piece because in actual fact, that can be used for soup or your salads. It's perfectly fine. So I'm taking this whole part, the pith, all the white stuff, all the seeds, and I'm going to throw that away. Now, what you're left with is these four walls and the bottom piece. So now, if there's some um, white membrane still left on, just cut it off, but naturally cut away from your hand when you're, when you're slicing. Put the tip of your knife in and just take off the white part that you don't want in your salads or your soups. Again, do this always away from your, away, slice away from your hand, not on your hand. So then, you've got your four walls and you line them up and now you just cut them as if you were doing like pepper sticks for a vegetable tray or, or carrot sticks or celery sticks, same thing. So start with your sticks. And if you want a small diced, start with small sticks, this size. Right? Same thing all the way if you want. If you're doing a ch uh, like a gumbo and you want big chunks of pepper, then cut your, your sticks or your slices a little bit bigger. So I'm taking all of my pepper into sticks, including this little end piece, which is very juicy. Now I'm just going to turn them all, and you can either divide this pile in half or just keep this pile, doesn't matter. And now you just simply dice into the size that you want for your, for your pepper. So this is a perfect, this is perfect for a um, soup dice. If you're, you're um, going to throw these into a gumbo or a chicken noodle soup or, so there you go, there you have it. That is without a doubt the easiest and most efficient way to actually um, cut through a bell pepper rather than getting the seeds, these dreaded seeds that don't taste very good at all, all over your board and then into your, into your soup or whatever it is you're making that day. So thank you for watching Cooking Uncovered and this is the best way to cut a bell pepper. And thanks for watching. We'll see you later.